The humanitarian situation in the besieged Gaza Strip is deteriorating, with hunger escalating among Palestinians, according to aid agencies. The United Nations General Assembly is set to vote on an immediate humanitarian ceasefire in the ongoing conflict between Israel and Hamas. The U.S. recently vetoed a Security Council resolution for a ceasefire, leading to further civilian casualties in Gaza. Gaza's 2.3 million residents, most of whom have been displaced, are struggling to find refuge and food in the densely populated area. The Unworld Food Program reports that half of the population is facing starvation. UNWA, responsible for Palestinian refugees, emphasizes the widespread impact of hunger in the region. Reports from Gazans include instances of people dying from hunger, cold, and bombardments. There are also concerns about looting of aid trucks and soaring prices. Israel argues that its measures, including instructing people to move, aim to protect civilians while targeting Hamas fighters. The Gaza Health Ministry reports that Israel's retaliatory assault has resulted in the deaths of 18,205 Palestinians and the injury of nearly 50,000. The upcoming vote in the General Assembly, although non-binding, carries political weight and reflects global sentiments. U.S. President Joe Biden, despite facing criticism for supporting Israel, reaffirms his unshakable commitment to the country. The U.S. has come under scrutiny for its support, with concerns raised about the use of American-supplied weapons and reports of detained Palestinians in distressing conditions. The UN calls attention to the dire situation, with 1.9 million people 85 of Gaza's population displaced. Israel announces plans to enhance aid shipments to Gaza by implementing a new screening system at the Karim Shalom border crossing. The recent breakdown of a ceasefire laid to Israel's ground offensive, causing further clashes and casualties. As the conflict persists, Israel's use of weapons and alleged incidents, such as the use of white phosphorus munitions, are under scrutiny. The U.S. expresses concerns about these reports and urges clarification from Israel. The situation remains complex and intensifies as military operations continue, affecting civilians and drawing international attention to the need for a humanitarian ceasefire.